tools you will need. In this lesson, you're going to learn the tools that you need to speed up the entire product selection process. Product selection is a time consuming and sometimes frustrating process. To speed up the process, we use several tools. Now these are tools we actually use ourselves for finding products and are the only ones we recommend. Trying to find products without these tools becomes very difficult indeed. So two of the tools require the Chrome browser to function. If you do not have it, you will need to install it. It is free and you do not need to use it for everything you do online. You can simply use it just for your Amazon business if you prefer. It's a very simple process to install the browser. Just go to google.com forward slash chrome forward slash index HTML. That will bring you to this page and all you need to do is click on download Chrome and then follow the instructions. As I said, it's a few clicks. It's very, very simple to install. The search string. Now, this is not actually a physical tool. We use this search to enable us to see all products without using a keyword. All it is is the minus symbol followed by eight or more random letters. And they must not make a word or result in a suggested keyword. So something like this example here. And I'll show you a quick example of this when we get to the last tool in the list. Google Sheets. So we use a spreadsheet to keep track of nearly everything in our physical product business. We will be sharing the one we use with you in Google Sheets. It is free and all you need is a free Google account. If you've already got Gmail, then you don't actually need to create a new account. But if you haven't, just go to google.com and sign up for a free account. This sheet will grow as you move through the course and is an invaluable tool to keep everything you need in one place. Once you've signed up for your Google account, all you need to do is type Google Sheets into a Google search, click on the first result, and then click on Go to Google Sheets. Now in the next lesson, when we actually start building our list of hot opportunities, I'll give you a link to the sheet we're going to be using. The last tool is Jungle Scout. The Jungle Scout Chrome app is the best product selection tool on the market, no question. It pulls all the information we need for every product on a search page, so we don't have to scroll through them all trying to find ones that match the criteria. This dramatically speeds up the process. And we have negotiated a 45 day free trial for all our members. You can sign up for this deal anytime before module five is released by clicking on the button in the ASM dashboard. And the 45 day free trial does not begin until you sign up. But remember, you must sign up for this offer before the end of module four. So let's go and take a look at it in action. So here we are on amazon.com and you'll see in the top right here, the JS, that's actually the Jungle Scout extension. And what we do when we start searching for products, and remember we'll be going through this in great detail in the next lesson, I just wanna show you a quick example. So we're typing in the minus symbol and then just hitting a random number of letters. Now while I was typing, you probably saw some results pop up like this below. Now it's important that your string doesn't show any results underneath. So if I go back and then I just add a few more, you can see there's no results underneath. Then what we do is we click on all and we choose the category we want to search in, in this case, baby, and then click search. And basically it's pulling up all the products in this category, which is obviously invaluable to us because we want to see all the products and not the products just related to one specific keyword. Now, very quickly, it pulls these results roughly in order of BSR from low to high, but the results are never perfect. And I'm just gonna activate the Jungle Scout extension. If I click on it, it's gonna give us this pop-up box and it's gonna pull all the listings from the page. So we don't even need to scroll down and look at them individually. You can see that it shows the BSR, which is the rank here. You can see all the numbers. And straight away, we can see that all of these are too low. They don't fall into our BSR ranges, but it also shows you which category they are in, which is kind of useful. The other pieces of information, it estimates how many sales per month are made of this product. It estimates the revenue, which is just the number of sales times the price. It's showing reviews and pretty much everything we need. Now it does have other ratings it shows you like LQS, which is their listing quality score. This is not something we pay particular attention to. Checking for a product's viability and, com and competition we find it's much easier using the method you're gonna learn in the next lesson. And they also have this opportunity score. Again, it's not something we particularly play with, but obviously it's something you can play with if you wish. And if you put your mouse cursor over the product name, it throws up a quick image. But we'll be going into much more detail in the next lesson on how you can use it. Your mindset. So your mindset is probably the most important tool when it comes to selecting a profitable product. 
We will give you all the information you need to succeed and also obviously we're showing you the tools that will help you do that. However, the selection process is still a time consuming process and can be frustrating too. But as long as you remain patient and focused and are willing to follow all the steps, you will succeed. So what's next? So now you know what tools you'll be using to find your hot opportunities. In the next lesson, you're going to start using them and actually start building your hot opportunity list full of profitable products. Your action step, install Chrome. If you haven't already got it, sign up for a free Google account if you haven't already got it and sign up for the Jungle Scout offer when you are ready. That's it for this lesson. Take care.